Hello everyone. Welcome back to HS Academy. Today we are going to learn how to use had better in grammar sentences. So let's get started. All right, look at the example sentence and the meaning for had better. Your sickness is getting worse. We had better go to the doctor today. So what's the meaning of had better in this example? Had better means that you should do something. If you don't he do this thing, there will be a problem or danger in the future. One important thing to be noted is that, had better is very similar to should. We use should to give advice to people. To say what we think, someone else should do. So, I think you should buy this dress because it looks pretty. However, had better is different to should because, if we give someone advice using, had better, if they don't follow the advice there will be a problem or danger. Do you understand? That's the difference. Should is for general advice. If I say to my friend, you should try this chocolate bar. It's delicious. If he doesn't follow this advice there's no problem or danger. It just means he doesn't eat the chocolate bar. But, if I say to someone, your sickness is getting worse. You had better visit the doctor. In this case, had better means if you don't follow this, there is a problem or danger that could happen. So, if you don't go to the doctor, what is the problem or danger that could occur? The sickness could get worse they might develop another illness and they could, God forbid, die. So there are many problems or dangers, if you don't go to the doctor. When you have a sickness. Now, the problem or danger doesn't always have to be very very serious like death or sickness. Another example I'll give you is this one, imagine there's a very, very busy Italian restaurant that I want to visit. I say to my friend, let's visit the Italian restaurant. However it's very very busy so we had better book a table in advance. Why did I use had better? Because there's a problem or danger that might happen if we don't book the table. Now, the problem is quite small. It just means we won't be able to eat at the restaurant if we don't book in advance, but a small problem is okay. We can still use had better in this situation. So let's move on to the structure of this grammar. The structure for had better in the positive is simply had better plus a basic verb like walk, see or go. So the example sentence that you can see below. We had better leave now, otherwise we will be late. You can see. Had better, plus, leave. Leave is the basic verb. Now look at the negative structure for, had better. The negative structure is, had better, plus, not, plus, a basic verb. The example says, you had better not be late for work. There is an important meeting today. So you can see the structure. It's highlighted. Had better, plus, not, plus, be, which is the basic verb. And finally the question structure. This is quite rare. We don't often use had better in a question form but we sometimes use it. So here is the structure. The structure for had better in the question form is hadn't plus I, he, she, etc. So you can put a pronoun here or a name of a person plus better plus a basic verb. So the question below says, hadn't we better drive? It's quite far to walk. Let me highlight one thing about the question form for had better. It's usually used as a negative. So you saw the structure, hadn't, plus, pronoun or name, plus, better. So, hadn't we better drive? The negative actually means positive. It's strange but this is the way English works. Sometimes English is a strange language. So if I say to my friend, it's very very cold outside. Hadn't we better drive to work? I've used. 
the negative, hadn't we better drive but I'm saying I think it's a good idea to drive. I'm not saying, I don't think we should drive I'm saying, we should drive. Just remember that. If we use, had better in the question, it's usually negative but the negative means positive, it means I think we should do this. Let me give you another example to make it clearer for you. If I see some children playing on a busy street which is very very dangerous, I can say to those. Children, hadn't you better go to the park? It's much safer. I used the negative, hadn't you better go to the park but this negative means, you should go to the park. I think it's a good idea. If you don't follow this advice, there will be some dangerous situation or problem that could occur. Now it's time see some examples, this will train your brain to master had better. My toothache is getting worse and worse every day. I'd better book a dentist appointment as soon as possible. Everyone is tired after the long journey. We'd better stay in today and relax. Alex is extremely busy in there. You'd better not disturb him for a while. Hadn't we better put a bigger lock on this door? I'm worried about thieves in the area. You'd better not sit too close to me. I have a cold and I don't want you to catch it. That's all for today video, thanks for watching, and if you like this video please give us a thumb up and don't forget to subscribe our channel.